Negative childhood experiences frequently result in negative consequences. Enyel noted several decades ago that based on clinical observations, psychological deprivation and traumatization appear to be more common in some chronic pain patients. The findings of a meta-analysis of the link between chronic pain and childhood trauma show that those who had abusive or neglectful childhood experiences have a higher chance of developing chronic pain in adulthood than people who did not have abusive or neglecting childhood experiences. Physical or sexual abuse were the most common forms of childhood maltreatment examined in relation to pain in prior studies. However, there is evidence that emotional abuse and neglect are equally important in their associations with pain, anxiety disorders, and the coexistence of pain and anxiety. Five signs of childhood trauma in adults. Extreme emotional changes. Sometimes controlling your emotions is difficult. It's a much tougher battle for people who have repressed childhood trauma. All because of something insignificant, you go from relaxed and at peace to with anger or anxiety. Often this shift occurs because that seemingly little detail subconsciously reminds you of a repressed childhood experience. Strong unexplained reactions to particular people. Have you ever met someone who made you feel odd right away? Even if you don't know the individual, your mind and body alert to you that they aren't safe. As a result, you may feel uneasy or necessary to escape the situation. This emotion could be triggered by the fact that the individual reminds you of someone who has brought you pain in the past. Attachment issues. Traumatic experiences can cause developmental changes, which can lead to attachment issues. You may find yourself becoming overly attached to other people and being sad or emotional when they go. Even if it's simply your partner leaving for an evening out or a friend leaving town, it may cause a lot of stress and anxiety. Childish reactions Immaturity and childish outbursts are common. However, if you find yourself regressing into a childlike state on a regular basis, you may be coping with negative experiences. You may be struggling with suppressed childhood memories if you have childish responses. It's possible that you have temper tantrums, speak in a childish tone, or you are stubborn about minor issues. Lack of ease in certain places. Places can also trigger feelings of worry, fear, and anxiety in someone who has repressing childhood trauma memories. Your brain stored everything, the colors, the smells, and the noises, when you first had your traumatic encounter. Being in a setting that reminds you of your suppressed childhood memories may reawaken that fear and send you into fight-or-flight mode. Recognizing the symptoms of repressed childhood trauma in adulthood is just the first step toward healing. You must recover those memories in a safe environment where professionals can assist you in comprehending and coping with the trauma. If you think this video helped you, please like and share with those who need it. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.